because Molly and I are not in America anymore. Where are we, Molly? We're in France. Eee! More specifically, we're in Paris. Paris. All right, so we are here in Paris, France to go to Disneyland Paris and see the city itself, but first up is the parks. We are staying at the Santa Fe Hotel and we have checked in. We took every mode of transportation to get here. I didn't film any of it, but it was a long journey. Cars, planes, trains, you name it. We took it all to get here and we finally made it. So that's a relief. I know it doesn't really look like we're on Disney property because Paris is a little uh, odd in that way, I guess. It's um, hard to tell. So it's like everything that we've seen so far, which is not much, but everything has been American themed. So it's really odd. It's like we're not in Paris yet. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. So anyways, um, we are heading to the parks now and I will show you guys everything there. I'm so excited. This is crossing something huge off my bucket list. Wow. Let's go. So luckily they have a Starbucks at a resort. So that's convenient because we need coffee very badly. We haven't slept. So we've got our Starbucks now. We feel like we can take on the world, sort of. Her says Marley on it. It's fine, that's my but new day. That's all right. This as tastes long as we have coffee. coffee. Yeah, it does taste a little bit different, but it'll help. And now we're waiting for the bus and we honestly don't know where it's supposed to pick us up, but we're just gonna figure it out as we go. So they have a bunch of American cities on this wall, including Los Angeles, and they're showing Disneyland. Well, I, I figured we could vlog at the same time. <laughs> All right, you guys, this is the moment we've been waiting for. We have our tickets. It has Daisy Duck on it for the 25th anniversary. And this is the entrance. We're about to go inside. So we've passed security. Over here is the Disneyland Hotel on the right. Straight ahead is Walt Disney Studios. Where's Disneyland? We don't even know where to find it. We're gonna figure it out. There's not very many signs here. So we figured it out. You have to walk through the Disneyland Hotel to get to the park and it's gorgeous. Oh my God, this entrance is so pretty. Oh. And the music. My heart is so happy right now. So this is the entrance and if you don't know, this year they are celebrating their 25th anniversary. So they have special things going on, decorations, shows, character meets, so we're super excited to see what they have. Look at how gorgeous this is when you enter the park. This is the first thing you see. They have these projections with the characters in the castle. It's so pretty. We are walking down Main Street as we speak. It's so surreal. Everybody's waiting for the parade. What's it called? Oh God. The Disney Star the something. <laughs> you guys, this castle. What the heck? I'm so overwhelmed. So this looks like Tomorrowland, but it's actually called Discoveryland, and we're about to go through here because the parade's going on, and we're trying to find Amelia and Emily. So we are currently trying to find our way around. It is such a strange feeling being lost because we're so used to knowing the parks by heart, but we're actually using a map and trying to find out where we're going, and even the map isn't helping, and we're getting lost. <laughs> Look at Wally and Eve. <gasps> the most adorable. We have been reunited in Disneyland. Yay! 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 It's a small world. It's so pretty and aesthetically pleasing here. So this is Alice's maze. And there's a treasure cat back there. So we are walking through the middle of the castle right now. I've heard there's a dragon somewhere here. So you couldn't really hear Emily in this part, but she was telling us how they have these tunnels you can walk through instead of walking down Main Street, and they are designed to protect guests from the cold weather in winter months. glimpse of Main Street. Oh my gosh. They have a little pavilion over there decorated for the 25th. So right now we are headed into Walt Disney Studios and I've heard not to expect much from this park, but I'm still going to go into it with a fresh outlook and I will see for myself. This is what the entrance looks like. Here's Sorcerer Mickey, my favorite. I love the dedication. So 
So strangely enough, this is where the partner statue is at. It should definitely be over at Disneyland, but it's here. Very interesting choice. So they have this shop on Main Street called Lily's Boutique and it's right next to Walt's restaurant. Oh my gosh, how precious. I am in love. They have this little vanity with a bunch of pictures of Walt and Lillian. How cute are these? Look at the size of this popcorn. It's so big. Yeah. Huggy Chans. Huggy Chans. Huggy Chans. Tidy Chans. And here we have sleepy, 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 dice sleepy Chans. This is my bunny, it's Mufi. And this is Olivia Anastasia. Hi, right? Hi, number one. Here is the pink nose. Yep. And here's the other pink nose. <laughs> or one black guy and one pink guy. <laughs> Which makes her look evil. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, bye. <laughs> We are currently headed into Adventureland and we haven't explored this part of the park at all yet so I'm really excited to see what they have. Guys, we've discovered the French version of Dole Whip. So far, Adventureland feels like an extended... Wait, <laughs> what? Extended walk. So far, Adventureland looks like an extended... Oh, I can't speak. <laughs> what extended do you need? <laughs> <laughs> From what I've seen, Adventureland looks like an extension yeah. of Morocco and Epcot. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Prince Ali, fabulous Ali So this is the Swiss Family Robinson Treehouse. <laughs> Treehouse. And it's just so different from the one in Disney World. So here's Thunder Mountain. I've heard so many good things about it. I can't wait to get on it. And then here is the little boat. It's called Molly Brown. What do you think about that, Molly Buck? <laughs> so we are heading to Phantom Manor, which is their version of the Haunted Mansion. I'm so excited to go on this. I've heard great things about it. And it's located in Frontierland, oddly enough, but it's only a 15 minute wait, so very excited. Mommy, I'm scared. Oh, honey. This is scary. We have the right to be scared. It's... <laughs> there are dead scared? people. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, I'm not kidding, but it's gonna be okay. Oh my gosh, it's just like they have in the Haunted Mansion in Walt Disney World, but this is through the queue, guys. It's in both French and English. Amazing. That's what I think the Haunted Mansion should be. It should be that level of creepy. I was slightly terrified. But the animatronics are really good. And I loved it. And it was our first ride of the trip. So I will always love it for that reason. I loved it. Yay. Yay. Spooky. 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 <laughs> what are we doing, guys? We're waiting for the fireworks. For fireworks. Disney Illuminations. Yeah, it's gonna be. It's, it's called Disney Illuminations. Um, reflections, nice demons. <laughs> reflections of Paris. Ah. Yeah. Within each of us is a dreamer just waiting to be awakened. We all have the magic to unlock this magic. But sometimes that inner child needs an invitation to come out and play. This is your invitation to dream. You 
You guys, Mickey is saying goodbye to guests from the train station. This is incredible. Oh, Mickey. What do you think? Pretty magical, huh? Well, don't forget, when you're the one that made it real magical. Oh, <laughs> my heart. Okay, so we have finished day one at Disneyland Paris, and we will be back tomorrow bright and early since we have extra magic hours. Super excited. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Goodbye, humans.